welcome to the channel the name is guru boy today we do have the techno spark 7 which has google account lock on it and the device is also running on android 11 so first for us to be able to remove the google account lock on the device we need to connect to the wi-fi network so if your wi-fi network do have a password make sure to input the correct password of your wi-fi network and then connect after connecting to the internet to check for an update so after the update you will be required to input your previous security lock being set on this device before hard resetting the device so i'll be fast forwarding this part so when you get to the copy apps and data click down copy so they will prompt you to provide your previous security lock which was being set on this device before hard resetting it so mine was parting so you see i should verify it i don't know it so i'll use google instead so when you try to use google instead you will be required to provide your google account being locked on this device before hard resetting the device so if you don't know you will have no escape button for you to escape or proceed so all you have to do is to move back and have a sim card that has a pin on it so in this tutorial we are going to use a sim card that has a pin so pull out your sim tray and now insert a sim card that has a pin or a lock on it so all we are, we are going to do is to make sure we have a sim card that has a pin code on it so the moment you insert the sim into the, the device it will prompt you to input the sim lock code so you will not provide the code so you will pull out the sim then the moment you pull out the sim you press the power key when you pull the power key then you power it on again we will do it again we need to have the lock wallpaper on it so pull out the sim power off power on keep trying to you you succeed so you may fail for the first time power off pull the sim tray power off power on now we have it so now pull down the notification panel click on the settings click on it now going for the settings now from here click security warning going for sound in sound scroll to you you see add a ringing tone so from the ringing tone you see three lines on top of your left hand now click and hold the drive it will take you to the drive now go into permission click on search so in the search search for x share after searching for x share click on it to open it now click open so when you get to the air share you need the second device to send these apps to the device so on the other phone you need x share to transfer your apps to the lock device so now let's connect to the lock um let's connect the lock device to the other phone so now let's look for the app that we are going to send I will provide the links for the apps in the description of this video so first we will send Google account manager quick shortcut manager and FRP bypass these are the only three files we are going to send to the log device so after accepting our permission scan the QR code wait for it to connect So when it connects the app will send to the other device so after sending it to, to the other device to automatically install but if it keep you can wait for it to finish installing from this point or you can move back or disconnect from the other net device and move back to the to the history so we'll move to history 
in history you will now have to install it from here by clicking on install so when you when you install you can move back to the application to check if the app has been successfully installed so all you have to do is to make sure the apps have been installed successfully so you can move to the application to check you have the apps installed successfully so if you are new to the channel please make sure to subscribe to the channel so here we have it the apps have been successfully installed so move back to the or quit from the X share and move back to the search bar and search for quick shortcut now open the quick shortcut click ok so from this point search for launcher so if, when you search for the launcher click on it too so here you have it the launcher click on it hit on try so it will take you to the home menu so in the home menu scroll up to the application menu and go in for settings and i will have to connect to the wi-fi network since we connect to the xi i lost connection of the wi-fi network and make sure you also have connected to the wi-fi network before we proceed so when you have been successfully connected to the wi-fi network move back all you have to do is to move back to the app menu and go in for frp file bypass so when you get here click on the three dots browse browser sign in click ok to accept the, the terms now from here enter your google account id or address so if you don't have a google account you can create one on a new device then come in here and log in simple as that or you can even create it from here so after inputting your google account address click next from here input your password and then click next now wait for it to finish now you've successfully signed in to your google account successfully to make sure you can go in into play store to check now that we have it installed successfully let's move to make sure cut and search for um andres setup so uh, we have android setup we have two android setup click on the um, first one scroll to the last part of the android setup click on it then hit try now wait for a second then your phone will be successfully bypassed but from here please do not pause the video there's something you need to do to make your phone fully work from here you have everything working perfectly but all you have to do is to you you will not be able to install apps from other source or unknown source so all you have to do is to keep following the procedure and if you are able to make it to this point you successfully bypass your device so make sure to like the video and also comment in the comment section let me know what you, you did face so here we have it the device is the Technos Pack 7 run on Android 11 so from this point when you go to your farm manager and this is the problem you will be facing so you have to follow the procedure to the end go to the file manager when you try to install an app app their package installer will automatically close and it won't install your app for you so let's let me try and show you you see it, it did not work you, you will not be able to 
install any apps apart from installing apps from play store or x share so all you have to do is to move to settings then in the search, search box you search for you search for factory reset so click on factory reset now erase all data so you do have a google account sign in so erase all data so after erasing all data you will be able to install apps on this device again and do everything so if you've made it to this point make sure to subscribe to the channel share the video i'll be fast forwarding this part after factory resetting the device you will be prone to the hello screen again or the hey aos menu click start to set up the device for this time you will not need any wi-fi connection all you have to do is to skip the wi-fi menu after just a second you have to choose your country so i'll be choosing ghana that's my country click next skip so when you get to the wi-fi menu now you do have the skip button over there click on skip to skip the procedure now i get to the terms click next more more than accept So thanks for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new to the channel and also give a like to the video if this video helped you. And if you find this video helpful, make sure to give a comment in the comment section. And also all apps being used in this video will be provided in the description.